Welcome to Cannibal Cafe. In the fucking head, the crooked DA I'm talking about. The big map of New York is still alive, mafia motherfuckers. Right now, we need to win the hearts and minds of the city of Denver, the state of Colorado. We need the real people behind us. And the only way we can do that is by remaining civil. intelligent dialogue. You're demonstrating on a demonstration. And it's our fucking right. Fucking it's our fucking right. I'm not serious. And by not falling into the trap of Planned provocateurs, they could be government funded, they could just be people that do that for a living, you know. But we know they're here. Uh, provocateurs across everybody of the whole Occupy movement, keep your eyes open for provocateurs. That's the biggest danger we have right now. They want to try and create an uprising that's a violent uprising so they can smash us down, instill martial law, and freeze the elections, amongst other things. So if there's one thing I can say, it's remain peaceful. Remain sane. In 1989, the former Soviet Union, the primary enemy of the United States for over 40 years, collapsed in a matter of days. You have no idea how close we are to taking over. And we're going to do the same thing in Egypt that the people there are doing. We're going to find the cops, beat up. Are you threatening us, sir? <laughs> I'm going to say there's a revolution. Are you us? No, I'm not threatening you. I was a supervisor here. Are you threatening me? That's a stupid question. No, it didn't. I'm a lawyer. I know what I'm saying. You're, I got it all on tape. You're harassing me. You are harassing me. I might be, but you are not. You are not the 99%. You are the voice of positive rights, of stealing from one to another. Theft is not the voice of the 99%. They're stealing from us, buddy. No, they are not. No, not. What has they stolen from you? Nothing. No one has stolen anything from you, except the government, if that. I am, you are not. Let the high praises to God be in their mouth and the two-edged sword in their hands. To execute vengeance upon the heathen. Right. Oh, yeah. Right. Right. Why don't you try reading the word? We'll see you there. That's why you have symbols of anarchy. No, That's why you come here with your bullshit mask. What does anarchy mean? Tell me. The Antichrist. Oh, oh, oh. oh. she doesn't know shit. Oh. 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 About self-government. We're here because we all collectively realize that this world, and especially this country, has gone so far from what it was supposed to be. The original America, 1776, the American dream, no longer exists. The change has to come from within first. We have to change our spending habits. We have to change what we do with our money. We have to change how we treat each other. That right there, that right there is, the key is the key to us winning. To us winning. We're all listening. We're all listening. We're all speaking. We're all speaking. We're all unified. We're all unified. We are the 99. shall coin the money and adjust the value to meet the markets, to meet the inflation. But since we have had a central banking system, they have caused every economic collapse this country has ever experienced. Educate yourselves about the Federal Reserve and the 